Hi, I'm Ken Dern. I'm a biologist with the Ohio Division of Wildlife, and I'm here in a barn in Union County uh, to talk to you about barn owls. Uh, this is one chick that I just pulled out of the box that's up behind me. Um, I'm going to tell you about an opportunity that we have for you to help contribute to the conservation of this beautiful owl species and tell you a little bit about uh, what they require habitat-wise. So, to start out with a little bit of history. Back in 1980, there was very few barn owls in the state of Ohio. The Division of Wildlife decided to help them out by installing nest boxes in barns throughout the, the state. This next box that we pulled this um, little one out from was one of the originals that we put up in 1988. At that time, there was over 18 active nests in the state of Ohio. Thanks to the nest box program last year in 2012, we had over 100. Um, However, the Division of Wildlife uh, thinks that there are a lot more barn owls in the state. And so we would like to hear from you if you have one in your barn. To know if you have a barn owl in your barn, there's three things to look for. One is to actually see the adults or the young. Um, the other is to hear the adults or young, though they're quite noisy. And then the third is to find pellets that are laying around the barn. The adults are pretty easy to identify. They have a white heart-shaped face, kind of like this little one has. Um, their back is... Uh, a golden brown um, and white speckling, and they're under, and the underside of them is really white. So these are a very, very light owl, light colored owl, um, and you'll see them uh, sitting in rafters in the barn or in in silos. The chicks, like this one, you can see, um, are fuzzy. This one's about five weeks old. Uh, I know that because I know when these hatch, but you can also tell from the amount of feathering. Um, that's developing on their wings and then how much feather it has around its face. Now uh, this one, its feathers haven't quite fully developed but as you can hear its voice definitely has. The adults sound just like this one. It's kind of an ugly scream and uh, some of the old um, haunted barns um, are probably because of barn owls. If you walk into an old barn in the middle of the night and you heard this sound coming at you I imagine you would think that it was haunted and probably wouldn't come back. Uh, the chicks will also have a begging call that they do to their parents when they're hungry. If you hear this in your barn, look up in the sky because the parent is either flying in with food or is flying out to find more food. If you have barn owls living in your barn or nearby, please call 1-800-WILDLIFE or email us at wildinfo at dnr.state.oh.us. Thank you.